a little around the back to the front. This is how I usually had my hair before, like kind of back and short on the sides. Now when I have it like back, it looks terrible. The only thing I'm really like kind of nervous about is the shape of my head, but we'll see. Coming up here and also on the other side, of course, it's like going in here. It's basically going straight up here. Probably will have like an island here for a while, um, but I think it's going in here and going back. I like hats and I do this. Just recently I've started to not want to take off the hat because I don't think it looks good anymore. Some will say like it looks fine, looks okay I guess, but I don't like it so that's why I'm doing this. So yeah, this, this is how it looks. Yeah. Wow. And straight to the back. Wow, so thin. No. But that's something that actually struggles with a bit. Uh, dry skin. Wow. Oh, it looks. I mean, this is what my hair will probably look like if I try and grow it out in a couple of years again. Wow. It's so crazy to see yourself. I'm gonna go over here. So thick here. Let's keep going. Wow. Wow. Well. I wonder what people say now, because this is like my normal face, I have like resting bitch face, but as a man. And people always come up to me and ask why I look angry or you know, people in bars and so on have always kind of like, I don't know, for some reason want to pick fights or you know, whatever. Because I look angry, but I'm not an angry person. But I wonder if that will get even worse now when I'm bald. But yeah, my skin is really dry, so I'm looking forward to getting that dealt with. Overall my head shape isn't that weird from, from right now, you know? It looks so nice. Like honestly, I'm, but it's really hard to get the back. Cheers boys. I'm not done here, but it is what it is. Wow. It's actually so nice. Like I actually already love this. I think it looks okay on me. I'm not really hating it. I'm glad I did this. Holy shit. <laughs> it fits so nice. It does feel nice. I do like that I still have some hair at the moment, you know. If that will fade, of course. And I think seeing the rest go will be easier once you're at this stage, you know. So this is what I bought. I'm gonna do it slow. Ooh. Nice. I'm done. And like I said, I don't really hate it. I think I got a pretty good shave now. This is how it looks. Cheers, boys. You should do it. The funny thing is, like just a couple of days later, I had uh, a big gathering with friends. So that was fun to show up uh, bald. Some people were like shocked and like, ah, oh, looking good, man, you know, and all that stuff. And some didn't even notice it at first almost you know and some of the like women they asked like why did you do it and i told them it's like i'm getting thin in the front i'm not really liking it i've been thinking about it for a while and i just decided to do it i do like when it's sh when i have like a short fade like two days okay uh, yeah yeah in that's when i think it looks really good and like up to like three four days i'd say you're literally in the in the best zone there in the sweet spot because Obviously, you can either, like you say, razor it off, and then in a couple of days, you've got that like three, four days where it's like yeah. for you ideal. Or yeah. like if you're going with the clippers on the zero, I guess it would maintain that kind of length yeah. like regularly, you know? So, man, that's awesome. That's awesome. So, tell me about the moment. I mean, you were up for it, right? But was there any yeah, sort yeah. of 
hesitation or any sort of last minute <laughs> you know, not really no I, I think i built it up you know in my head you know and like i told you i had like a beer even prepared i enjoyed it pretty much uh of course it's kind of funny you know i was kind of happy while doing it you know yeah and it's like i, I started in the middle build it up in our heads and even though like i said i wanted to i was kind of insecure about it in a way that i didn't like i wasn't sure what to do with my hair pretty much i would say for a year i didn't really want to get a haircut because it doesn't look good and i just kept it you know and didn't think about it that much then i started to think about it not really liking it thinking the summer's coming up might as well just shave it try it if you don't like it you can always go back you know so that's what i thought as well like i might as well try it out uh, i was also really like curious about my head shape yeah, I was going to um, ask you that. Yeah, tell me about your okay. thoughts. Yeah, I think so. I'm not sure. But yeah, I'm liking it. Uh, and like I said to you as well, like for a couple of years, I did rock that Fury haircut, you know? Yeah. Um, and I like that as well. But I've never been that guy, you know, with spending a lot of time in the mirror, fixing my hair and using products. Uh, so I think this will fit me pretty well, you know? Yeah, well, what would you kind of, how would you summarize it? And, and what would your advice be? My advice would probably be, first of all, if you're shaving, prepare some products uh, if you think you will need it. Because I did that and it's been fine, you know, because my skin did get irritated and so on. So you probably know your body, you know, so prepare whatever you think you, you might need. Try it out. Like, it really isn't such a big thing that we're building up in our heads. Maybe it is for, for you who's out there watching this, but I would say try it out, see how it feels. Set a date. Or something like okay in two weeks when i have like this window here that i don't have work for like a couple of days or something you know do it then it's fine uh, i would say don't be so hard on yourself you know because that's another thing i wanted to go on here to say is like if you're battling with like low self-esteem depression or whatever don't let this be another thing to get you down shave it all off and move on like this is new you you know don't let another thing get you down like your hair you can't control it that's, that's pretty much it you know it's yeah. not worth to feel really bad and to get yourself down and to feel crap about it you know wanting to have a hat on instead of going to the beach with you know your friends or your family or that girl that you're interested in you know said shave it all off if she doesn't like it move on you'll find a girl that does like it and will like you for you and you know you're also lower on Tinder. Who cares? Go out to bars, you know, show off your new self-esteem. And we, I don't know, we put too much energy on it, you know, I would say. Um, you can always reach out reach out to me. And, uh, you know, you have been so helpful, so nice, you know, our conversations and so on and so on. So reach out to Harry as well. Like, yeah, it's really cool. If they feel stuck, you know, move on with something, you know. So a lot of people do feel these things and it's the same with your channel that's why i like it so much because you see a lot of men who are really insecure about it or who feel like you know really really sad about this stuff do it see how you feel try to feel better you know like try and move on from this instead of going for like four years feeling crap about your hair try and get rid of it maybe you feel great in a week you know yeah instead of going for another two years you know feeling like that cheers boys